What's up guys, Chooch. I'm gonna be showing you a quick little tutorial on how to install power pads on your electric unicycle. Now this will work for really any power pads out there. It'll even work for the power pads that are split in like two. Um, you, you just, this really is like the be best method to install them. Um, what you're gonna wanna do is get a magazine out, like a magazine or a piece of newspaper or a piece of poster board, anything like that, or even a piece of paper will work. But you just wanna take it and then kinda put the, the piece of paper or magazine behind the power pad like that. Um, and then this is really gonna help because you'll be able to get it exactly right, guys. And like with, with these new power pads, these are the new uh, Clark pads. And these are really, these are power pads you don't want to open up. Like you can cut them in the middle and make them a little bit wider, but these you wanna get perfect on there. And like with a lot of the power pads that you can cut, I would suggest not doing that and just getting them exactly right like this. See, I got it dialed in right there and then I just pull the magazine out from behind it and I got them exactly where I want them. And then there's no fussing around with it, no fooling with it. This is the best method by far to install them the way you want them. And I mean, it really does feel right. Like once, like, it, like right there, it looks like my toes were too far for it, but it felt right. I rode with them like this all day, and it just kind of shows like you you can really um, kind of get wrong. Like it, you just want to make it feel right. Like it, it doesn't really matter where it is. Just try it for your personal preference and use that method and get it to where it just feels right. And it may be a little bit different than somebody else rides, but the whole po important thing is getting to where it just kind of locks you in, where you can jump around easy with it. And you just want to be able to effortlessly get these to where you can just go into like a, a curb or anything like any anomaly you need to unweight and jump over. You want them to be low enough on your toes to where you can just unweight naturally and just jump over any obstacles or anything like that. I see a lot of people that have their power pads way too high up to where their toes aren't even going to um, impact those power pads to pull them up. You see right there, that's the way you want them. You want it to where... It's, to where your feet are like locked in on it to where whenever you unweight at all um the wheel comes up with you just like that and it man it felt great once i got i just unboxed these power pads guys and went for a ride and it feels incredible these are these new power pads from clark pads these are called the concept three bio pads and he just sent these out to me and i did a full ride with them i'm going to be doing a review and ride with them next but man, I can just tell you right now, they were great. And I love this because the whole thing is that front pad has a lot of flex to it. So if you hit any bumps or anomalies, it's not abrupt. Like if it, the, with the old pads that are more rigid, it is too abrupt. If you hit a jump or anything like that, and it kind of can knock you off balance. But these are great. Full review coming.